Okay, so a new video on the channel today, guys. So a topic that I've really wanted to talk about for around one or two weeks now, right now is the kind of the fakeness of social media these days. So basically this will be like a no edit YouTube video. I just want to share my thoughts on this topic as they have arrived uh, in my head for some time now. Uh, I have just been procrastinating a lot on getting these thoughts out into the real world for you guys. So for some time now, I've realized uh, a lot of new things about social media, uh, things that I wouldn't have thought about before. So right now, every day that I look on social media, I feel kind of uh, trapped in a mindset that, you know, someone else has something better than me or someone else has something more than me. Or while I have been procrastinating uh, watching this video, someone else has been working out on their own goals. So uh, when I just go, for example, on Instagram, uh, I try to do it just once uh, every day. And that really helps me a lot not get into that whole mentality of uh, uh, watching how everybody is doing and what are they doing uh, because that's just not who I am and I know that it will just not improve my life overall so uh, I really try to focus and understand that uh, everything that I see there like on this screen like on an iPhone or Android is just something that it's not real I mean um, lately I have seen a lot of people like uh, if you see them like on social media, especially on Instagram or even YouTube that I, uh, these are like the two platforms that I mostly use. So you can see people in a, such a good lighting and in such a good way that when I have seen them in real life, they're like completely different people. And I'm not talking about specific cases here, um, but all of you, I think, know such cases that like when you see like just a great person on social media and when you see her in reality, like, it's not that wow effect or that great effect. And I know this like kind of has to be true because not every like real person like in real life is like wow, like it is in social media. So it's something normal to see that. Um, but you have to keep in mind that on social media, everybody's life tries to be perfect, which in reality it isn't and it can't be because um, every single life has its ups and has its downs, unfortunately. And you have to understand that no one wants to share their like low moments or moments that they have to work hard for their goals. And everyone just wants to show their successes and how they want to manifest into their online presence because they think that that is kind of important to them and that will lead more people to like them, to appreciate them. Uh, for example, me, I don't really derive a lot of pleasure from uh, watching other people's stuff because I know that most of it is just really, really fabricated towards a certain type of persona. And I know that that can't affect me because I'm not in social media for promoting some values that are not like me in general. I try to be as natural as possible with everything that I do. And I know that this might sound kind of cliche or unreal at all or I don't know things that I might say that I not like in real life and for example yesterday in the evening I got a comment about how I just posted about SMA cold calling and I wanted to just be real and I've tried that to be in most of my videos I know I have a lot of them that are might or are kind of clickbaity and I know and I understand that uh, I know that I did that like more for the algorithm to grow the channel, to discover it more, but I've always been a firm believer in um, knowing yourself and being true to yourself and posting something online that is really representative of you, uh, despite what other people might think of. Um, sometimes I had a feeling of posting an Instagram story that like, what if someone will see that or how would they react to that? But I've just realized that that, that that fee that's something that I can't just control and people will re always react positively or negatively to you but you can just uh, be there and think that their opinion should matter a lot to you of course if like my mom for example tells me that hey maybe you should change it or you may not like it I mean uh, of course I will give it like great importance to that but I won't change my values just because someone will tell me that hey maybe what you're doing is wrong um, when that thing really represents me a lot and 
uh, you really have to be okay with that and watch everything online with a grain of salt like it's something which I have really implemented a lot uh, in the past around 3-4 months and I have been really much happier ever since I try not to spend as much time on social media and it helps me a lot because I try to listen more like for example to podcasts or going on long walks in the park or just on the street and it helps me like detach from all of these online things that um, most of the people online promote being successful at a young age or just having your life in order when in reality when you see most of those people they're like really really different i'm not saying they're like bad or they promote something they don't believe in uh, i'm sure most of them have like good motives for doing it it's just that they want to portray a persona as i said that they're not who they are and they just want to appeal to people that want more out of life but don't know how to get that because their self-worth might not be as much and it's important to acknowledge that and really understand where you fit in the picture and how you see because in my opinion right now with social media it is the same like it's with news uh, you have to have different sources for your information to really understand it if it's something that you value or it's something that you might think will bring something more or better to you but in the end doesn't really matter so that's kind of the main point that i wanted for this video um, I hope you might change something in your opinion about things, how you view them and all of that stuff and I, if you have any questions just leave them down below and I'll be glad to answer and yeah, uh, happy Sunday everyone and I'll see you in the next video, bye bye.